Well, today here at Grantham, we have the international exhibition. There are actually 100 images which were selected by selection panel when uh, the finalization of the images was done. And there are about 100 images, but they're scattered all over the places. Large murals, I believe there's a plasma screen, uh, all images as well. They're absolutely beautiful images. They're artistic in a way, and yet they have scientific information in it. So it, it combines the two roles. Uh, but predominantly, yes, they are scientific images, but they're beautiful to look at. In fact, general public would appreciate it as much as scientists would appreciate it. I think it's been the fascination with the images, um, particularly um, when people have read the explanations. Some of them are very beautiful in their own right, but actually reading the explanation and finding out what the, the images are about has been fascinating. Um, and I think the children particularly like the ones of the, the um, microscopic images of bugs and things that um, are very appealing to them. But some of them are just very beautiful um, in their own right. It's fascinating that the, the range of images across the whole range of, of science and things like that is very important. Almost every scientist of one sort or another needs images to record what they're doing and how and so on. But it's now the ability of sharing them with the wider public that makes the uh, wider interest. I hope uh, the public will enjoy it. Lots of people have enjoyed it right from the launch. People have been delighted to see the images and fascinated. Yes, it's very important.